G'day ladies and gentlemen, Pidget here and welcome back to episode 26 of Sky Table. So yeah, just a re quick recap what we did last episode, and that was this thing right here. Beautiful, so I'll quickly fly up and have a bit of a squeeze around. Uh, well, I think we actually did this uh, to the actual map maker. Uh, yeah, he did qu <laughs> quite quickly point out I didn't do enough height on the top level, so the, the Enderman didn't really sport up the top there, but meh. I fixed that off camera, so that's now working just fine. And so, yeah, and also I just worked the bottom. So rather than just having the, um, uh, the just sort of open there with then the uh, obsidian pipe and the stuff blowing into it, I actually put a uh, transposer there now. So each time something lands on that pressure plate, yeah, the transposer just sucks it into the chest. And, oh, shit. <laughs> I honestly didn't even know that music disc was even there. Uh, that must have happened when I was swapping all this over. The, the uh, skelly must have shot a um, a creeper. <laughs> I honestly did not even know that was there. That is awesome. That is brilliant. Oh, man. But anyway, as you can see, it's then going through this uh, transport pipe, and it's coming over here. And going into this one. And as you can see, there's a nice lot of uh, material just building up there. And of course, as you can see, I do have some ender pearls, so it is working. Uh, the way I've also and the other thing I've also done too is this thing. I actually added three more of the energy collectors at the bottom of this, so now there was actually 17 there, and it's actually now a properly efficient, uh, well, energy flower. I suppose you call it EMC flower. So yeah, and so yeah, that's pretty cool. That's all that does now. Okay, uh, other than that. I think everything's working reasonably well. Hope you haven't run out of too much fuel. Oh, yeah, you're getting close, actually. I'll fix that up later. But uh, it's all good at the moment. Yeah, damn, they are getting low. I might have to just fix that up. Uh, just bear with me, ladies and gentlemen. I'd like to be back when I've actually done this. So, yeah, just so you're not getting too bored with me doing this crap. So, I'll be back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Uh, basically, just uh, topped up those machines. And also, and it also just became nighttime, so I uh, just slept. But uh, yeah, so let's just quickly get on with this episode. What we're going to be doing is I'm going to start doing, uh, well, I'm going to start doing some I, uh, some IC2 stuff. And pretty much the first thing I want to do for that, though, is I want to do some, well, need to collect, get some energy so the machines and all that will work. And the best thing I thought I might actually do for that is I might actually do like a, like, is it called like a water well, maybe? A water system to actually, or... Is that what you're going to call it? I'm not quite sure what you actually call it, but uh, no doubt you guys have probably seen like Die Wolf and plenty of other people do it. Basically, it's just using like the water, uh, yeah, the uh, water mills to generate energy and yeah, they output it into an MFE or something like that. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I know I probably could just use like a generator at first to start it off, but hey, whatever. I'm going to do it this way because it seems cool. So why not? And also, the other thing I want to quickly just show too is, is that at the moment you can see it's in creative mode, or not creative mode, it's in uh, cheat mode, because the other thing is, these three items here, silver, ingot, the uranium ore, and a nickelite, uh, because I cannot actually mine, I'm pretty certain these things, well, these things have not been taught to this uh, transmutation tablet, or table. So I'm not sure if I've done these earlier, but I just want to do this on camera so you guys can actually see it, and apparently I can't learn nickelite. Oh, that's on matter, okay, it's obviously a fuel source then. Okay, try again then. Boop. Okay, I must have learnt these things before, but I just wasn't sure, so I wanted to make sure, that's all. How much? Okay, so a bit of uranium is actually 4,000. Wow, that's a lot. I wonder why these didn't show up before. Okay. That is learnt. I wonder why these never showed up before. Maybe they did, maybe I just never noticed it. Okay, so yeah, anyway, now they've been taught to the machine. I'm Because I NEI'd these things in, that's why I'm getting rid of them now. And now I'll quickly just turn that off cheat mode. Boop. Okay, sweet. Okay, so the first thing we want to be doing is we want to start making ourselves a couple of items to get this thing cruising. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use... Actually, I'll start using this one because this one's actually bigger. And there's plenty of EMC in that thing already, so that's neat. So what I want to do is I do want to try and grab myself some... Some silver. So what am I going to get to... It's going to give me some silver. I might just grab myself a bucket and see what that gives me. Yeah, it's going to give me silver. So 512 for a silver. Okay. So I want to grab myself a stack of that. Wow. I just used the wrong client star anyway. You idiot pie. Let's go. I could chuck that one in there for now anyway. Won't. Whoops. Won't take long to charge that thing back up. Uh, because the other thing I want to do now also is, if I stop spinning around like an idiot, 
I want to, uh, what's the fuel source? Is that, I'll grab myself one of them. Because I hope that should give me some Nicolites. That's yeah, beautiful. It's giving me, give me just what I want. And I want to actually start giving myself some blue alloys. I blue, what am I putting that in there for? Uh, I don't think I need all of that. Probably don't need all that either. So hopefully that'll be enough to give me just a, uh, a few to tick me. Actually, yeah, and that should be enough. And I might just do like uh, you see some commentators do. I might just cut and crop a, the video because it's going to be a little bit tedious in what I'm doing. But I'll at least just show you basic recipes. So there you go. Yee, blue alloy ingots. So I want to get a couple of these because I want to make myself some blue alloy wire. And I've got to also make myself a heap of other things as well. So this should be pretty cool. Okay, so I'll get some of them. Have I got any wool in here? I do. Okay, so to make the blue alloy wire, let's get some of the uh, blue alloy ingots and some wool. That gives you 12 of them. That's going to be heaps. I don't need any more of that. Uh, I should have plenty of red alloy wire. Sweet. Okay. And now what do I want to do? Actually, one thing I do want to make is a silicon ball. So I'll just type in silicon. How do I make this thing again? Oh, so it's sand and coal. Okay. I should have... Okay. So I don't have enough of that. I'll just target that. That should give me a stack of that. And coal. You're going to give me coal? What's the fuel source I can steal? I want coal. There you go. Okay, that was sort of, Wow, that does burn through there pretty quick. So I want eight of them, and it should be eight of them. I think it will probably be enough. I can easily make another one if need be anyway, so. I, I, might, I might do another one actually, just to. Uh, that'll do. Just get myself a couple of them just so I can make some blue ones and red ones if I need to. So I'll just tick this through. Boop. Don't want to make any more. There'll be heaps. And diamond saw. Oops. Didn't mean to chuck that on the ground. And I believe I chuck them in there with them. Hopefully that'll... Uh, be enough of the Nicolite to start ticking these over because I need a few of the uh, silicon wafers. Because I'm going to make myself a couple of solar panels. So yeah, let that go through. But anyway, one of the things I do need, I do want to make is myself. I do make myself a couple of uh, a couple of machines. One of them is a deployer. And I'll quickly just give myself the basic recipe for that. So it's a chest, piston, redstone. Okay, hopefully I can remember that. Chest, uh, no piston. No piston. Okay, no pistons then. <laughs> no pistons. I'm out of pistons. At least I can't see any of them anyway. They're not in there, are they? No, they're not. Okay. Uh, need to grab myself one. And piston. No. Uh, crud. What am I going to do to give myself a piston? Do do. This is giving me all sort of high end stuff, isn't it? What that give me? Ah, oh, beautiful. They'll give me plenty of pistons anyway. I might need to drain that out of there. Okay, so... Piston, redstone... That and the chest should give me the deployer. Beautiful. How's this thing doing? Not going to have anywhere near enough uh, nickel, I don't think. So I'm going to have to get myself some more. Should stop doing that actually because I think the um, I've got a heap of them in the uh, in my chest I think. Actually, I know I've got heaps of them because they're in there. <laughs> Should stop wasting the uh, <clears throat> the EMC out of the client star. And okay, so that's pretty cool. What does it do with all that? Did I chuck. I did chuck it in there, didn't I? Sorry, I got myself distracted. Okay, so that's the deploy done. I want to make myself a uh, a filter. So let's make a filter. Get the recipe. I'll make a filter. That's not that's not what I want. That's what I want. A red dope diaper, piston, gold, and okay. 
So I should have... Do I not have any red dot wafers left? Wow. Apparently not. And you're not doing much more. I'll let you just do this last one anyway. Because I need this thing. Okay, chuck them in there. Give me that back. Because I need this. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Awesome. Okay, so chuck that in there. No, wrong one. Piston, two gold. Okay. Oops. Piston there, some cobblestone, and I need a couple of two. You're gonna give me gold from that? No, it's alright. I'll just snag myself a few out of there. Boop boop. Ah, get off there. <laughs> and we are looking pretty good. Now, what I might start doing is I might start just at least just placing some things down on the ground. I want to give myself a couple of buckets. Let's go top one of them up over here because I want to give myself an infinite water source. Boop. And, okay, let's fly over here. So I've got to find a spot to put it anyway, so... Um, ooh, where am I going to put this stuff? So I'm going to I'm gonna have to smash a hole in the ground anyway, so... I've got that on me, that's good. Plonk that through there. And we can... Now I'm gonna just... No, wrong. Fail. First block, fail. And up. I could actually hide that probably a bit better, but... Nah, I'm not gonna worry about it now. And hopefully that one should work there. Perfect. All right. Now this is going to probably cause a bit of a uh, bit of an issue, but hopefully it won't be too bad. Now where's the deployer? Hopefully I place these things properly. Excellent. Okay. So then behind the f behind the deploy would actually be then putting the filter. And this is obviously going to be in the ground slot. I could do it above ground, but I want to be uh, clever and trying to do it above ground. I mean, above ground. On the surface, or I was slightly in it, so... Ah, that didn't work. Didn't do that properly. I have to go get the uh, screwdriver. Come on, sprint. There we go. I need to rotate it so it's... That way? No, that way. That's better. All right, so we've got any of those pneumatic tubes because I need a heap of them as well. I don't think I do. No, I don't. Yeah. Okay. I have to work out how to get them. Actually, I think it's uh, the brass and uh, glass. Brass and glass. Excellent. Hey, so I'll give myself a couple. So I'm gonna need a, I'm gonna need a few of them anyway, so come over here and dump this down. So you can probably get an idea of what we're actually doing here already. Sweet. Now where's that going? Cool. And now the other thing I do want to make is a retriever, I believe it is called. Okay, so better look up on the retrievers. And it is crafted. Now we're gonna have a filter. We're gonna craft another one of them. And a couple of ender pearls. So yay, I can actually do that now. And some brass and some ooh, leather. Hey cowies! At least because they're in there, I might have to go kill one of you. So don't let me down. Okay, so. I just created myself a filter, so hopefully I don't forget how it's made. And one of them. I might have to... Is that four of them, I think? Yeah, it is four. And 
and what's the cobble? Boop. Hey, so I think on the other one, another one of them actually, don't I? So that gives me the filter. And no, I don't. I just need the blue alloy ingots. And so I can go brass. I forgot it already. <laughs> oh, right. That goes there. Need some iron. Hopefully I've got some iron on me. Yeah. Okay, where does put the iron? Oh, there. I can tell you I've got a memory like a sieve. Uh, just call me a goldfish, because that's what I'm like. So leather, put into pearls, and blue alloy. So there's the blue alloy. I hate to do it to your cows, but guess what? Oh, you, you sod. Are you not dropping leather, or don't you drop leather anymore? Because if you don't drop leather, I'll be very cheesed off. Thank you, you did. Now I've got no cows. That's alright. You, you probably knew. No, you didn't know leather anyway. So I, was, I was just saying, thought, uh, I should have checked that. <laughs> oh dear, that's funny. But anyway, it does know them now. That goes there, and of course, I'm now going to... Just bear with me for a second, because I've got to go... Snag a couple of them. And I probably actually should teach this thing to, these to my trains table as well, actually. Now I think about it. Beep, bit of beep. Yeah, sweet. Okay. And that should give us the retriever. I'm going to have to uh, come over here and I'll place this thing down. And then I might actually just clean out my inventory, I think, because it's getting a little bit out of hand. <laughs> okay, so I want to place that thing. I think like that, because the way the thing's going to work is obviously you're going to have the deployer and you're going to have buckets in there. Boop. And then the filter is going to have a filled bucket in it because then this thing's going to be, because the deployer acts like a right click. So it's going to right click in the water, fill up a bucket, and then the, it's going to get pulled into the filter and the filter is then going to fill out the uh, bucket into, I'm going to have some pneumatic tubes out here. And they're going to then go into the water mills, and of course, then we're going to have the. Then they're going to come back to here to the retriever, and of course, the retriever is then going to have an empty bucket in it, which I probably could actually just do right now, just for the sake of doing it, like that. And yeah, so that's what a little loop. So then it just basically feeds through the cycle. Pretty cool. Okay, so that's those three things done. Okay, a bit of a bite to eat. Wow, it's a whole day going past already and I didn't even realise. Wow. Time flies when you're having fun. Okay. Uh, what do I need to do now? Do, do, do. Let's think. I'm trying to think, actually, if I... Well, I've got a few things there. Because I need to make myself a timer as well. Um, I need to... Fuel them and some stone. And I'll clean up some of this mess for now. Oops. Come back to all that later on. I'll grab out what I need. Yeah, it's still messy, but it'll do. Okay, so I think I need three some of them, but I need to get myself a I know I need a stone cathode. And I know I need a pointer. Probably should really look it up, shouldn't I? Just to make sure I don't screw it up. Timer. So stone cathode, pointer, anodes, a couple of those ones, and I need the red wire, the uh, redstone. I think it was three of them. Okay, so unless of course I'm much mistaken, it should be like this. Here's the pointer, cathode, and those two. Timer! Beautiful. Didn't take as long as I thought it was going to take. <laughs> and I'll quickly grab myself some... Uh, do I not have any red? Oh, there it is there. Here's the blue alloy wire. Cool. I'll come over and place these things. So I'm going to place uh, that there. Not I suppose it really has to be just there particularly, but it is. 
Okay. And I'm going to have the that going on there. So it's actually now it's going to be, although it is actually working, it's not going to be doing anything at the moment. But that's how that's now that redstone is going to be activating all those machines. It's pretty cool. And I'm going to quickly uh, just place some blocks down there like that. Just so it's uh, got an area to fall onto. It's pretty cool. Oops, I forgot to place these things. And hopefully just here... Oh crap, I lost it. <laughs> I'm actually going to now make myself a battery box. But before I do that though, I believe I need to make myself some batteries. But actually, I'll just look up the battery box first to see you guys can at least see the recipe. So to make a battery box, I'll need another blue alloy ingot. Some iron and some wooden planks, but also need to make a BT battery, which is nickelite and copper and tin. So hopefully I've got some... Uh, no tin? No? Okay. Hopefully one of them should give me... Uh, tin, should give me plenty. I just say thought wasting all those other ones. Look at these ones here. Okay, and that's some more of the tin. I should grab some of that. I can burn bronze, copper. Okay, now I'm gonna suck the rest back into that and grab that back out of there because I can grab myself a few of these ones. Nikolite. And I need to get myself some, I think it's four of them and one silver. Do I have a silver around? Do I lose the silver? No, there it is. Good. Because I need one blue alloy ingot. Uh, so, one, two, three, four, I think it was. Oops. Four of them there. Uh, where's the iron? Did I lose the iron? Oh, actually, so what am I doing? I need to... Whoops. And... Fourteen... And... Copper. Or was the other way around? Might have been the other way around, actually. Beautiful. Okay. Finally got there in the end. So yeah, this is pretty cool. Hopefully we'll get this thing up and running pretty quickly. Hopefully I won't have to edit out, edit, edit out too much. Um, so then just got those. Just need a bit of wood. A bit of wood. And there's the iron. And cool, cool. This is quite work. This is working out quite well. I'm quite liking this. Nice. And, yeah, cool. And I'm going to chuck the battery box. I probably don't have to put it just here, but I'm just going to dump it there anyway. That'll do. Cool. And now I need to make myself a couple of solar panels. I've got those, and I need to make myself a couple of blue alloy ingots again. So it should be eight of them and two silver. Because now this thing should, to make these things, it should be a circle or like a, I suppose you call it a circle of the blue dark wafers and two, al or an alloy ingot in the middle. Just like this. And nope, that. Cool. Ha <laughs> ha. Awesome. And I should be able to pretty much just place. Are they going to charge? No, they're not. Bugger. Um, <laughs> I'm going to break these off, and if I lose them, I'll be ultra pissed off. Okay. 
I might have to actually place them next to it. That's the only thing. Okay. I know it'll take a little bit for it to for it to start working, but I'll do that anyway. I know that should work. Yay! There you go. It's getting some charge. I could, I could actually put another. I could put a battery in that just to help charge it up quicker. But by the time I get the rest of all this done anyway, it's probably gonna be just about there. So, cool. Uh, we pretty much have almost a working machine here. The only thing I really need to make now actually is some generators and make the water mills. Because I believe the water mill should be... Uh, I probably should just look it up. No, that's not... That's better. It is the wood, wooden sticks, and... It, oh, it's a generator in the middle. Okay. That's all right. So I need to make about five generators. Okay. And I will just tidy up my inventory again. Because <laughs> it gets a little bit out of hand. I'll just put some things away. I'm not going to rat too much. Dump those in there. They can go there. Awesome. Don't really think I need the redstone much anymore. Okay. All right, sweet. Uh, so what's the, oh yeah, that's right. Generators. Uh, so I need a few of them. <laughs> need quite a few of them, I think. So I want to make about 10, I reckon. Okay, so that's that. Um, oh, great. I should have actually started this before. Oh, actually, no, I shouldn't. What am I talking about? Don't worry. I'm just, I actually know I do because I need to cook the... I need uh, refined iron, don't I? So... Where's all my iron I've got there? At least I can start cooking you up. Cool. Hi Star. What am I doing? Keep forgetting, just use these. Saves a lot of time. That'll probably be heaps anyway. Well not probably will be, it will be. So all I can do now is start waiting for the uh things I've got to actually I should probably just check it up, make sure. Is it a battery it needs? I think it is. Uh generator. Yeah, see it's a battery. Which is, wow, it's a copper wire. And I bet you I haven't actually got any, oh no. Anyone notice the flaw in my plan here already? <laughs> oh dear. Bet everyone else is going, dude, you can't do this till you got the batteries. Ah oh, man, that is unbelievable. Because, where's the, uh, do I not actually have the... I'll do a bit of sticky resin. I can't do this, but it's just going to really put a bit of a bit of a backlash on it. Okay, so I've got that. Pick them back up. And you know what I should just do? I'll just grab one of these. I keep doing the wrong thing. Okay, so I'll need to get myself some stuff here. Start burning that up. Because I need to get myself some of these things. Rubber. Oh well. I thought there was a flaw in my plan, but for the life of me couldn't think of what it was going to be. <laughs> I don't think you can teach rubber to the uh, this thing, can you? No, you can't. Damn. Okay, so that's alright. We'll get there in the end. Not a problem. The only thing I do need to do is get some of this copper. Make that into wire. Well, that was probably way too much, but anyway. I'm not quite sure why I made ingots then, but... Yeah, I can do this to fill in some time. Actually, you know what? I can't bother. Just do one more. <laughs> they can just go in there for now. Okay. So, you're going to need a bit of wire. Uh, how much do I think? How much do I need? Yeah, you probably need a huge amount. Need probably 12 or so, a bit more. I'll just get this next one, these they'll get us up and running. And doop, sweet, I'll get them out of there. That goes there, that's cool. 
Battery there, and and and, and. I completely forgot what it is now. In case you get the recipe for the battery, why won't it show that? Oh, there we go. So yeah, so it's tin, redstone, and a copper cable. So I need to get myself some tin. It's redstone. Seven of them should do. At least if we can just get a few of them up and running for now, probably uh, better than not at all. So, oops, what am I doing? Wrong thing. Some of the refined iron there, that's pretty good. I'll just make these ones up into cables. Perfect. Alright, so now I've got a few batteries. All I need to do now is chuck some of them in there. And where that refined iron go? No? What am I doing wrong here? Ah, oh, I've got too many machine blocks. God. Numbskull. It's either you do that you can do that recipe if you have the iron furnaces there. But duh. Okay, so now I can start throwing some of these things together. And where's the batteries gone? There they are. Generators. Cool. Just give me almost a couple more. That one go there. Another furnace and a battery. Cool. At least as I said, at least this will now start us off, so we're doing pretty good. And I just need to get myself some sticks. So I might just dump some of this mark that I really don't need anymore. Out of here, oops, I need them. Okay, cool. Yeah, grab myself a few sticks. Probably not going to be quite enough, but it'll do for now. Cool. Because now I should have my pneumatic tubes on me. And with a bit of luck, we should be able to kick this thing along this way. And we should start seeing some production here. Hopefully, finally. After all that time wasted. <laughs> Cool. Now, the thing with this, you can actually go as, as long as you want. Um, you can go, I think you probably could do about 20 of these uh, these things, but meh, you know, you, you won't do too much more than that. So all I'm going to start doing now is start grabbing myself some, I've got some tin there. Can I make the buckets out of the, out of the tin? Should be able to. Uh, not quite enough. Better give me four of them. And I'll go fill them up. And do that. And that one there. Ah, oh, you idiot. <laughs> grab them from the center pie, or else you would muck up your sword source. There we go. I could have grabbed them over there, I suppose, but meh, whatever. Too late now. So now this one. Uh, actually, I'm going to break that off because I need to put a water bucket into that one. Now I can put that back on there, and this thing should just start pulling out water buckets. So I'm just going to put them in there anyway. Cool. And hopefully, if all is actually going well, are you generating power? Yeah, you got power. That's cool. I 
I might just break that one off just so I can some of these off, make sure they are going where they should be. There's not that many buckets going through the system at the moment, so you're not going to see a huge output of uh, what they're actually doing, but we'll click on this. So this one's filled right up. This one is nearly filled. I think it just filled up then. And these back ones haven't actually started filling up yet, so hopefully this one should start going into the back one sooner rather than later. But you get the idea of what it's trying to do anyway. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, uh, the other thing I'll quickly just make a few of is, I just forgot the glass again, if I've got any left. I need three, okay. That's okay, do that. No, that's not how you make the, uh... ah, damn it. What I want to make is the uh, ultra, if I can spell, is the, this thing, ultra low current cable. Actually, oh, sorry, it's just three ingots. Okay, so I thought there was uh, glass involved. My bad. Neat. So what you can do with these is, because once they start generating some, well, crap, when do you fill down there? Place these things on top. And then these things are going to start kicking out some power. So I'll bring it out a little bit. One more down there, beautiful. So now I want the power to start filling, or start to actually doing something. I think you're done for now, you're pretty good. I want to see if I can get at least one more generator made. I thought I, I, didn't, I didn't actually think these things made, I think the water mills is two. That's what kind of threw me off, I think. Uh, what am I doing? Battery. Cool. And last thing I just want to do, chuck that there. And we should be good. Beautiful. Where'd they go? Water mills. At least that'll fill up these eight slots that I've got. Perfect. Woohoo! Loving it. And the cool thing about this is I don't have to worry about keep putting the. Uh, coal or anything into it because of the infinite water source there so it'll just keep keep itself generating power all the time which is really really cool that's why i wanted to do it and yeah i'll just grab myself a few more pieces of tin just so i can do a few more of those cables because i want to just get a few more of them made and the other thing I want to do is actually, just to really finish it off, is I reckon an MFE will do quite nicely. Whoops. Just, put, <laughs> just punched my mouse across the desk. Okay, so, oh, there it is. Finally got the thing back. An MFE is some um, copper cables, machine block, and an energy crystal. Energy crystal is made with a diamond surrounded by redstone. Cool. Should be able to manage the crist the, uh, those crystals. I hope I've got enough... Good enough redstone there? No, well, too bad. I'll oh, steal one of them. That should be seriously overkill, but... Let's give yourself a stack of that. Burn it back into there. Okay. And... Here, I'm talking about the diamonds, then forget them anyway, so... Go me! That's those things done. And so I have any copper wire still? I've got copper wire still, of course I do. I think I just did that wrong. Did I just do that the wrong way around? Hey, what the hell? Oh, whoops. Stuffed that up, didn't I? And that one. That's better. I'll have a quick look at that. Get on their back. Come back here. Idiot. <laughs> okay. So that's them done. A couple cables. And... Did I not have enough for a machine? Oh, you're kidding me. One more piece of refined iron is all I needed. Dang it. Burn that. 
<laughs> ah, that's annoying. I'll just get them. Oh, she's there's no point doing that because it's the wrong crafting table. Let's wait for this thing to finish. Sweet. Give me that. No, stay there. Thank you. Okay, that goes there, and we get an MFE. Sweet. So now I can come over here with the MFE, and I can chuck that down right about there. Should do. And with a bit of luck, this thing's going to start generating power. Ha <laughs> ha! Excellent. I like it. I should do some stone there. So I might as well top that thing back up. Perfect. As I said, it's not pretty, uh, but it'll do. So yeah, there's the battery box. It's got the uh, being powered pretty much by the two solar panels next to it. Uh, it's got the blue, blue electricity wire or the uh, the blue alloy wire. I should call, I should call it. Is feeding into the uh, retriever because that actually requires that to actually uh, charge up, as you can see by this here. And then you've just got the deploy, which is the, like a right click, as I said before, sucking the water into there into the bucket, which is then being fed into the filter, then being fed through the lines, through the pneumatic tubes, and then filling up each one of these things. So if I click on this, it hasn't actually reached that one just yet. Or have I got a? Uh, have I got an issue here? I might have an issue here somewhere. Why are you not working? Have I mucked these up somehow? Would I, I, pro I probably actually need some... Um, I'm going to have to get some more... I'm going to have to get some more... Uh, what are they called? Buckets. Because that's the uh, that's the basic problem. Once you get the more of the uh, water mills you put down... Uh, unfortunately, yeah, it uh, starts costing you a bit more in the um, to actually uh, make these things. So yeah, I'm gonna have to. It's probably not gonna be enough. Yeah, it'll do for now. But you guys get the idea what it's doing. You can actually see it is working. It is slowly generating some power there. If I can open up this thing, chuck some buckets in there. They should right click. As you can see, they do right-click each time this thing ticks over. Probably can speed these up a bit, actually. I'll drop it down about a second. That might help sort of pull things through. You can see the buckets are now coming back into this thing. Cool. There you go. These ones are starting to fill up again now. I might just cover that up before I fall down it. Sweet. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is the water mill. It is now filling up the MFE, although it slowly. And, oh, that's the thing I haven't done too. That's why it's not working too well. What am I doing? I've got to put the uh, cables on there. So that's just going to be helping feed the power from these into the MFE. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that is the episode. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. So that's we started with some IC2 finally. And as you can see, this thing is obviously working quite well. Oops, not going to work too much through there. That sucked everything out of there. And so, yeah, let's. this is going to be pretty cool. So now pretty much what everyone recommended doing was me getting all the items to get a quantum suit. Which is pretty much what I want to achieve in getting. Uh, other than that, yeah. So that's pretty much what the next thing is on the agenda. So we'll continue on with this thing next episode. So stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we'll be back hopefully very soon. Hopefully I won't leave it too long between episodes. It's getting a little bit frustrating, that is. I've got to admit. I've got to admit. I know it's probably annoying all you amazing legends. But believe you me, it's annoying me just as much. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. I'm done. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, that cool stuff. And yeah, we'll be back very soon with another episode. So stay tuned. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.